Going back to Marvin Jones Jr. real quick, Nate, you were kind of in contact with senior there, Mr. Shade Tree, a little bit. But, you know, we're, 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 we're trying to think of something before the Notre Dame game to maybe have on senior. We'll see. But mm-hmm. going back to, you know, once again, you got junior on campus. And I want to bring up the picture here that the whole staff took of him. But kind of speak about maybe with some things that you were talking with senior about and, you know, what it means for him to be on campus once again in Tallahassee. Big time yeah, target. No, it's just follow the visits, you know. You know, for the, there's a lot of people that think that FSU just can't get him because of, of, you know, where they're at as a program, and you know, with, when you compete with Alabama and Ohio State, and you know, Florida State's still going to compete with them. One because of the family tradition and all the guys that have come from that family that play at Florida State, and, and, and two, they're just doing a hell of a job recruiting him, and you know, there's a need at the spot. Um, as we just heard from from Chris, you know, when they dial in on you, they dial in and they and they make it known how important you are. So, you know, the big thing with them is that, you know, the, it's not about who you are family wise. They're recruiting him as an individual, and, and and that's the most important thing I think with this kid is that he's his own person, and they're not relying on the family, <clears throat> excuse me, family relationship, so to speak, in order to try to land him. They're not trying to talk about legacy and all that kind of stuff. It's you are who you are as a player and, you know, we, we need you. So, you know, w- w- we need what you can bring to that table. We need it. So, you know, you're vital to the class. So, Yeah, exactly. And, and to your point, I believe it was uh, Zach Blostein from Knowles 247 that had the quote, but Marvin mm-hmm. Jones said something like, uh, whenever I come to Florida state, they show me more love than anybody. So I think it's yep. big that Florida state's not just relying on that legacy factor, but they're actively pursuing Jones as hard as they can and trying to develop those relationships to get them to Tallahassee. So arguably the two biggest, arguably the two biggest recruiting weekends that Florida state had over the summer, over this off season, he was at. So, mm-hmm. you know, that, that, that says a lot. You know, that, that says a lot. So, absolutely, it does. Yep. And going back to Elijah Pritchett, uh, Quashan Sapp told me that he's he was heavily after him that whole and entire trip there. They actually uh, were, were messing around with one another and actually ended up doing a photo shoot together. I know we'll be able to talk with Sapp and pick his brain on the whole recruiting weekend next week on the show. But that is a big time offensive line target. Big, 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 big time target and he's actually visiting Ab- alabama i think this upcoming weekend but i, w- you know, I wouldn't be surprised to, there. i wouldn't be surprised to see a decision you know relatively soon coming off that alabama visit <laughs>